good? Dark Knight Gang and this thing, I'm Brandon. Today I'm about to do another video from Apex Predator series. This one right here is titled Top 10 Savage Segments in WWE History. Y'all requested it, don't trip me not, I got y'all. Bro, it's Friday. I hope all of y'all have a great weekend. Remember, go after all your goals and dreams. You only got one life to live, my guy. So lay that bit up. Yeah, Sunday I'm dropping another, uh, I know I talk kind of fast sometimes, my fault. Sunday, I'm dropping another uh, spiritual video. So if you want to hear the spiritual video, tune in on Sunday. I think I'm going to start doing that. Every Sunday is either going to be a spiritual or advice video. You know, spiritual Sundays. Why not? Anyway, let's hop into this video, man. When I was WWE champion, Raw was the strongest brand. Now, Raw is an absolute joke. Take the women's champion, for Sorry. example. Beth Raw Phoenix. is trash. This isn't 90210. This is Monday Night Raw, and you're embarrassing yourself. Damn. Damn. Who are you supposed to be in love with? Only the weakest intercontinental champion in the history of the WWE, Santino Morella. Even with the broken clavicle, I could beat Santino. Randy Orton always been a savage, bro. Always. Not everybody has granddaddy and daddy behind them to usher them into the WWE. I don't take yeah. joy rides on my motorcycle at 3 a.m. and try to pop wheelies and get re-injured. Going from New York to Toronto, there is no bigger disappointment in life. Elias, shut Dang. your mouth. It's kind of like what the Stanley Cup. They'll oh, never God. see it in their lifetime. <laughs> kind of like you uh, winning a WWE championship. Oh! Thousands of other women. You want to walk with Elias? I have to break it to you, Trish. I don't date women in their 60s. Oh! They go at it. Fighting, not to lose. You need to watch your mouth, rich boy. Oh! Two years ago, your legacy died. Mm. You're just like your old man. From the very day that you were born, you've been your daddy's. <laughs> yeah, them fight words. I, I understand why they fought. They was taking low blows. Paul Haley used to go hard, huh? I didn't know that. Tuesday Night Smackdown or something? Tuesday Night Raw? Oh, well, huh. I'm about to open a can of whoop ass again. AJ Stavios. This is all your fault. I was about to say, was he saying that to uh. Just shut up for a second. Let me talk. This is why no one likes coming to New York. Why don't you put a little bass in your voice then? Why don't you Ooh. shut up, Steve? Nah. Why don't you shut up, Steve? In your old age, you've turned into a real asshole. No, set him over the top, bro. The goat, nigga. You guys hearing yourselves kissing my ass like that? Who are you people? Favorite demon right now? What the devil's favorite dumbass? Kicking ass and taking names or kissing ass and making coffee. From the most dominant superstar in history to the most pathetic. Why do you despise me so? Because I can get on all the rides at Disneyland and you can't. We knew you was going to make a short joke. Which brings me to Mr. Seth Rollins. I plan on making you my bitch. Jonathan Coachman, the coach. Ah, oh, nobody cares about you. <laughs> Chris Jericho, Y2J. Well, I guess it's better talking about the haircut that makes you look like a 12-year-old boy. Um, <laughs> and, and, and the rock. The hair, right, where's Triple H? <laughs> thought of that somehow made Stephanie McMahon pregnant. And they'd make them watch copies of the DVD, The Marine. Morella? Morella? Stand up. 
up, stand up. Where are you? Stand up. The Rock. Say, what's your name again? It doesn't matter what your name is. The Rock is You're talking. All of this. As big of a deal as you think you are. Cheap ass, corporately created John Cena bootleg. He said you were an industry player. He said you were an industry player, cuz. They boo you because, first of all, you suck. It's called a promo, mm. kid. Shut your and mouth, if you want to be the big dog, you're going to have to learn how to do it. So go ahead. You're just a fake bitch. Mm. He's a part timing fake ass bitch. I'm the one guy in the WWE. Roman Reigns has never really been good John in the mic, huh? It took you five years to cut a halfway decent promo, but now I'm about to shrink you down to size. I'm still here because you can't do your job. I can do this part-time better than you could ever do I remember full when he said time. that. Yeah, John Cena, yeah, he got Before the new day no existed, ass. dark matches and pre-shows is all you get. Oh. Whoa. And how you say you 5'5", five, five, but you really 5'3". We'll talk about that later. Just don't get all rated R like your boy Xavier Woods. Oh, yeah, he was smacking on the floor. No. Jamaican? Nah, you was Jamaican, but he stayed in the lane. You were absolutely nothing till your wife put you on total divas. Oh, he's like carrying bags on. for Roman. <laughs> you didn't know how to handle Braun Strowman, and you're never around to. You gotta be kidding me. You think you deserve a shot at this? You don't deserve, <laughs> buddy. You don't deserve, Drag us all buddy. Back down. To reality. Reality wow. is, I kicked your last night. That's the reality. <laughs> Later, <laughs> I'm putting your <laughs> to sleep. Who knows See you that? better than anybody? That? Man, hey, you look at me when I'm talking to you, or we can straighten this out right now. Who got beat down by Braun Strowman last night? Look at me. Now look at Braun if you can find him. This was actually a pretty savage video. I can't even lie. Great request, y'all. Um, yeah, Roman Reigns, he, he didn't do too bad on that one, like how John Cena said. I never really saw that promo for that long. You know, whenever they show, like, little highlights of it, they would just show a little few clips here and there. But Roman Reigns actually didn't do too bad in that promo. But a lot of these, yeah, they be talking some shit. They be taking some low blows, bro. Let me know your thought down in the comments. Y'all have a great weekend, man. Peace.